Hey guys, I'm here with Stefano. And today we are at VidCon, obviously, like who isn't right now? We are gonna be doing the Urban Dictionary Challenge. If you don't know what that is, um, we have a friend off camera, James Rona. <laughs> He's going to tell us some words that are on Urban Dictionary and we're gonna guess what they mean. Whoever's closer gets a point. Okay. You get to be the judge of who's closer, by the way. Okay, Always. so we have our notes out. Note out. Note out. out. Not ready. <laughs> Should we start easy or start? Yeah, yeah. yeah. The first word is boonies. 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 Oh, oh, I know exactly what that means. Oh, you should know, because you're from Jersey. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I feel like that's a very, like, East Coast term. I'm from the- I don't know what it is. Midwest. Midwest. I wrote boonie. A nice woman with a nice booty. Okay, I said it's it's far away, like, it's in the cut, basically. It's in the boonies. Yeah. What? Yeah. It's in the middle of nowhere. That's, like, yeah. the most random. <laughs> okay, the next word is chalked. Oh my god. No. I got it. Um. I don't think I'm right. Chalked. When you talk shit about someone, but they don't get upset. Okay. Um, I think that because like chalk, like when it gets wet, it goes away. So like. Okay. So I like yeah, the I like the thought process. Yeah. Chalk <laughs> to write all over. <laughs> I'm gonna go with him only because yes. neither of you were right, but he put a thought process what is, in. What is it? It's when you don't want something or you want to forget about it. Oh. Like you don't want anything to do with that oh. person. Oh. Completely wrong, but okay. So the next one is Mr. Fahrenheit. It's from a very popular song. Bro. Oh sh. I have no idea what song you're talking about. Uh, oh my god, wait, who sings it? <laughs> queen. Your queen? Okay, so I said Mr. Fahrenheit is somebody who is very hot. Okay. Obviously, because Fahrenheit is a high temperature. Okay, I basically put the same thing, but I was a little more specific. I said a very hot male. Because Mr. Oh Fahrenheit. my god. <laughs> I, Technicalities. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Like, literally, the definition is someone who is at least 200 degrees and traveling at the speed of light. Oh, yeah. I'm traveling at the speed, the speed of light. I wanna know. Really? You don't know that you? Song? <laughs> no. I'll just give it to both of you. Yay. Okay. Two, two. So, this term is marriage strike. I put marriage strike. After a divorce, you have a marriage strike. So, it's like you're. You have a strike. Yeah. On like your marriage. Oh damn! I was thinking yeah. very political. I was thinking like when people have a strike against marriages and like you know when like doma was a thing, how people were like, oh I don't want to get married if gay people can't get married. It's literally a time when people, due to high divorce rates, were literally, like especially men, were not getting married because they considered oh. it to be a financial disaster. Oh shit! <laughs> I said divorce. Yeah, yeah, you said so the yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yes! A Dutch rudder. So someone can give someone else a Dutch rudder. I like, literally have no idea, but I just, the game I just Dutch made Dutch. a wild guess. Dutch rudder, the act of shitting into another's vagina. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's actually um, an Alabama hot pocket. I think it's like when you insert something into another person's butt, but I don't know specifically what. It's actually... Having someone complete the act of masturbation by pulling up and down on the forearm while the male holds the, his penis. So it's like, the guy holds his own penis, yeah. and then the girl, or the guy, oh. whatever, does it for them. Oh! I would think that that would be a lot of work. Okay, neither of us were close at yeah. all. There's no, no point. So the last one is a Surrey girl. It has to do with like... That type of like what that type of girl is. So much pressure. Wait, who's winning? Uh, it's three two. That doesn't that answer my question. Oh, I'm winning. Oh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I think it's a girl who says yes to anything in bed, like a yes siree girl. You know okay. what I mean? That's so smart. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> I just I just said um a girl who goes to clubs looking for sex. It's a girl who gives it up for free, very little or a hit of anything. Yeah. But I think that's you. That's you. That, okay, so okay. tie, right? Yes, yeah, tie. That's cool. I'm cool with the tie. So we tied. <laughs> We have another video over on Steph's channel. I am teaching him lesbian slang. That's correct. And he's correct. surprisingly very good at it. Yeah. So you should check that so out. So check it out if you want to see me learning some lesbian words. I'll see you guys when I see you. <laughs> Just. Okay, bye. <laughs> I literally don't have an outro. I just like don't care. Hey, would you get